Hi, my name is David Crone. I'm a general surgery resident at Massachusetts General Hospital, and I'll be discussing our recent paper titled Anastomosis Time and Outcomes Following Donation After Circulatory Death Kidney Transplantation. We have no disclosures. At every stage in the transplantation process for a deceased donor kidney, time is ischemia. Donation after circulatory death, or DCD kidneys, are already subject to warm ischemia in the donor, but another underappreciated component of warm ischemia time is the time required for anastomosis in the recipient. Anastomosis time is a potentially modifiable risk factor. Longer times have been associated with worse outcomes, but this has not been specifically studied in DCD kidneys, which may be especially vulnerable to prolonged anastomosis time given the additional ischemic insult suffered in the donor. Therefore, we studied the impact of prolonged anastomosis time on outcomes in DCD kidney transplant recipients. We used the National Transplant Registry to study this. Anastomosis time was measured in quartiles, and our outcomes included delayed graft function and graft survival. Median anastomosis time was 38 minutes. As far as delayed graft function, patients with the longest compared to the shortest anastomosis times had 19% higher odds of delayed graft function after adjustment for donor and recipient factors. This is an adjusted rate of delayed graft function of 44% versus 37%. And for graft failure, patients with the longest compared to the shortest times had a 21% higher adjusted hazards of graft failure. In summary, prolonged anastomosis time is associated with higher rates of delayed graft function and worse graft survival after DCD kidney transplantation. When accepting a DCD kidney, one should consider the donor and recipient factors that may prolong anastomosis time. In the operating room, all efforts to minimize rewarming of the kidney and to optimize anastomosis time should be taken. Involvement of trainees is not precluded, but a thoughtful balance of autonomy can be granted as appropriate taking care to limit total time. Thank you to the journal for this opportunity.